Yesterday, ground penetrating radar located 11 possible burial sites at the former Charles Campbell Hospital in Edmonton. From the 40s to the 60s, the original Campbell building, now demolished, and the current building from the 60s to the 90s, housed thousands of indigenous children who were sick, mostly from tuberculosis. They were subject to experimental vaccines, reports of physical, mental, and sexual abuse. Today, those 11 sites were shown not to have any human remains. The radar picked up old construction debris like bricks. Edmonton-based Papa Chase members were on site and reacted to the development. This section over here is the next section that has to be um, used with, for the radar. And from what we're hearing from elders passed down um, is that the graves are over in the southeast corner. <laughs> So that's that's the big one. Well, frustration, yes, in a sense of speaking, because the government knew what was going on. And, uh, you know, they, they said they don't know, but I don't believe that one bit, because they've kept records of everything that went on. So don't tell me they don't know. They do know what, what, went, on, what went on. More of the site still needs to be searched. There still could be remains found here. This site is part of a $1 billion lawsuit along with 28 other federally run segregated hospitals. Chris Stewart, APTN National News, Edmonton.